Welcome back to another episode of Bedrock Zoo Survival Series. I'm Spunky Monkey. Uh, as you can see behind me, I, after all the hours in the nether that I spent, I only have two uh, skulls. So that's not going to do us too much good right now. So there's decoration right now. But uh, yeah, the nether fortress, as you saw in the last episode, is complete. Uh, you could still have to do all the signs and stuff, but I'm kind of done with the nether right now. So uh, what is the next plan for the zoo? You might ask, because I'm wondering myself. I'm really not too sure. So it is 1.8 now. We do have 1.8 installed, ready to rock. Uh, I had a little glitch problem, which you can see my levels are real low. I, I had some weird, I uh, slept in a bed and, and then I closed out the game after sleeping in the bed. And for some reason, when I came back, I was dead. So uh, I had to go all the way back to spawn uh, in order to get all my stuff back. But uh, everything seems to be working fine since then. Uh, but my plan for today is I, I am unsure. Uh, I'm kind of done with the nether right now. Uh, I know we're going to be back in the nether anyway uh, once we go to the Woodland Mansion because uh, I'll make another portal there and then track system from there in order to get the uh, mobs from the mansion here. Uh, so what my plan is today is I do have the mansion map on me and you can see we are south of it right there in the bottom right hand corner. So we need to go due north that way. Uh, so what my plan is is to start heading towards there and if we run across a jungle then we'll do the jungle next. If we run across the mansion, then we'll do the mansion next. So, uh, not sure what's going to be next for the zoo because of that. Uh, right now, I'm, I think I'm pretty well stocked. I got myself a bed, uh, a boat, a couple leads. Uh, keep a potion of healing on me or fire resistance on me. Uh, I have my ender chest all ready to go. Uh, jackpot here is quite empty. Give me my lead. Okay. So jackpot's quite empty. And, uh, yep, there we go. So I see we uh, start heading north. And instead, if we run into a jungle, we get to play with the polar, uh, the panda bears first. And, uh, you know, that could be cool. Either way, we're going to have to find a jungle. So I figure we'll just head towards the fortress and, uh, or the, the woodland mansion and see what we can find. Just got to figure out which way we want to go north here. We got a lot of mountains over here, I think, actually going this way around them. Probably end up being a little shorter, although a little more dangerous. Oh, chest just sitting here. I'll, I'll take a look for you guys. Uh, name tag, eh, not too bad. You got a couple of melon seeds. Not too shabby, not too shabby. But yeah, this uh, all these are still largely unexplored. Here's another chest right here. Let's see if we can open it up. Not bad, not bad. A little bit of iron, another golden apple. Ooh, look at all the mobs there. Let's see if we can get around them. Oh, ravine. See, and the reason why I'm doing this too is, you know, you can see my coordinates in the upper left-hand corner there. So if you want to go and check out this ravine, uh, you'll know exactly where to go when you download the map. So you guys can mark down these coordinates and uh, come and check out this temple. I'll leave it alone. Okay, guys. Look, okay, I found two two villages here still no jungle I'm hoping for the jungle I want to see the panda bears but we might be able to find some kitties around here oh, I think I just saw one there's one and hey, look at the kitties they're all over Meow. Ooh, careful there. Okay, well they're separate villages. They're not they're not together. 
Whoa. Another ravine, guys. See how these guys wander. Okay, let's uh, take a little breather here and check out the map. Yeah, okay, we're still not even showing up on the map yet. So we can go north or east a little bit. Um, it looks like that's just going to take me to water anyway. So I think what we need to do is get the boat out. There we go. Let's just go ahead and pop it down right there. There we go. Perfect. Okay. We're on the boat. Look at all the kitties. Yeah, we'll definitely have to collect up some cats for the zoo uh, so that we can help protect it a little more from... Oh, I didn't know they dug. That's kind of neat. Uh, yeah, to help protect it from the phantoms flying around at night. I think if we uh, strategically place them around the zoo, then we can... Uh, you know, help protect it from the phantoms because the phantoms won't dive down on you. Ooh, look at that. Diamond horse armor. It's really the only good thing out of there. So, I found you guys some diamond horse armor. Alright, we're approaching another darkwood forest. Still haven't opened up the map yet, though. But hopefully this will be the right forest this time. Oh, another village. Look at those two. Three. Wow. Wow, the dancing fish. Cool. How come I can't move anywhere? I see no reason why I can't get past this. This is really strange. can't get past this. It won't let me go forward anymore. There's nothing blocking me. I can't go in this direction at all. Okay, that's really strange. It's not letting me go forward past this point. I might have found a glitch, guys. I have a feeling I'm about to open up the map. It is not letting me go past this point. Look at even he's glitching out. Weird. Totally glitching out. Alright guys, well let me restart the game here. Alright guys, I'm going to bring you back. It's been a while since I've seen one, but I think that, is, that those are jungle trees out there. The big tall ones. Uh, I still haven't gotten up to where it started drawing on the map yet, so I'm not that close to the mansion yet. Uh, so... I believe that is jungle over there. Right, let me just figure out a way to get over there. Let's see if we can jump checkpot. Jump. Guess not. Come on. Yeah, that is jungle, guys. We found jungle. We have discovered jungle. Excellent. And it looks like a really good size one, too. And uh, look at it. It goes all the way around. Oh, sweet. Oh, I bet I got to cross the river again. Gosh darn it. Uh, yeah, sometimes riding a horse is not the funnest thing on earth. 
Okay, I see cocoa beans, which we don't have any of. Oh, we got jungle trees. And oh this is this is this is cool. Let's go ahead and follow it. So I'm thinking if I can get this uh, jungle to border the woodland mansion, then we can, uh, like I said, get both at the same time. Let's do this, do this. There we go. And now we can do this. All right, now we can take the boat and head towards here, but we've got jungle guys. Ooh, trident dude. Run away, run away. Uh, let's see, so the mansion is that way. I know it's not going to be easy to take jackpot through the jungle. Let's just take a quick little gander here and see what we've got. Yeah, definitely got some collecting to do. Uh, definitely pick up some of these trees, wood, and hopefully get some saplings so I can grow it back at home. That's the only thing I don't have in our grove. I forgot about the cocoa beans. Okay, so the mansion's still out that way. But we have a jungle, guys. So I guess we will stop here oh there's a parrot cool Let's see if we can grab some seeds here of course you're not going to give me any seeds and i want any wow give me a seed There we go. Oh, there's a, uh, okay. Yeah, this is definitely, we definitely got to stop here, guys. I see an ocelot. All right, let me get back over by jackpot while it's nightfall here. A panda bear. Cool. Hey, dude. How you doing? Well, well, hello. You don't want this seed, do you? Yeah, I didn't think so. Hello there. Oh, yeah. You got snot coming out of your nose. Yes, you do. You don't take the seed, do you? No, you don't want the seeds. Cool. This would be nice dealing with some docile creatures for a little while. <laughs> Very good. All right, I am like, I'm excited right now. I am hyped up. All right, let me uh, place down a bed and uh, get some torching going here. Might go ahead and do uh, another pillar. I think would be my best bet to be able to <laughs> have any chance of finding my way uh, back over here to jackpot. Wow, look at all the drown down there. And one of them's got to try it. Okay, let's take care of him. Huh. That worked out well. And I got to try it. That's what I wanted. Oh, another trident dude? Where's the trident dude at? Did I get him? Nope, there he is. Wow, I'm really collecting up some tridents, guys. I want the fish and the bones. All right, let me uh, get some sleep. Uh, let's see, yeah, let's put it right here. Yeah. 
There's a panda. Yeah, let me go a little higher. And this jungle is huge. Oh, I'm so happy that we found a jungle. I don't see any... Uh, I can't think of what the heck it's called. It's not sugar cane. It's uh, bamboo. I don't see any bamboo forests anywhere in here. So we'll definitely have to do some wandering and exploring in here. We got ourselves eight fish. I don't know, do we want to set up the portal here? Well, that's where my uh, thing is at. I guess we can do that. Let's go ahead and set up base right here. Now, let's see, panda bears aren't too big, so a two by two portal should work. Let's put it over here. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna do a little more setting up here and I'll, I'll start recording when I'm ready to explore. I might go to the nether first and then start working my way back so I have a place to bring them. Uh, yeah, I might go ahead and do that. So let me work on some things and I'll bring you back. Okay, guys. Uh, well, I have an issue with uh, Minecraft right now. Um, I was at this spot. You know, I had a pillar. I had a portal right here. Uh, ender chest, all that was set up here. I had a bed, slept here, and uh, after I stopped the last recording, I went to go take a break and turn the game off. And when I came back, I loaded up and died and was at spawn again. And if you look at my coordinates, I'm way away from spawn, so I started up the backup that I had made just before I started the recording today and had to come all the way back over here again. So I just want to give you guys a heads up. There seems to be some kind of a glitch. Um, I ran into that invisible wall again too and I had to stop about halfway here. I just wouldn't let me go any farther and I stopped and uh, turned off the I mean, you know, I turned off the, the game and just restarted the game and then I was able to continue on. I'm not sure what's going on, uh, but I just wanted to give you guys a warning that, you know, sometimes if you start up, you might die. Because I restarted again and then it came, it took me right back here where I had slept last. Except I didn't have any of my equipment, anything, because it was all over its spawn. Uh, so basically, like I said, I just restarted my backup and... Uh, came all the way back over here. I just got back here. So uh, unfortunately, after that long of a ride, I, I need another break. So I, I did stop and start uh, Minecraft again before I made this recording and everything worked. I came back here. So uh, I just wanted to give you guys a heads up and uh, we'll see what happens next. Um, I'm thinking though, instead of setting up the portal and stuff here, um, I'm wondering, you know, how far away we are from the uh, mansion. Because I would really like to set up one portal. If I can get one portal set up for both the mansion and the jungle, that would be just wonderful. So I think what I'm going to do is, uh, when, I, you know, when we come back, I'm going to uh, travel through this jungle to see if we can get closer to the Oh, it's a kitty. <laughs> Scared me. Well, I see I'll have to collect some fish again. <laughs> but, uh, cause, you know, I lost all my fish. But I, I, I think I, what I'm going to do is collect some of this stuff up. I'm going to, you know, collect some jungle wood. I don't need the vines, but uh, the the, uh, the, uh, the beans here. I can't remember what the heck they're called. But, uh, you know, I'll collect up some of those and I'll do some collection. And we'll just kind of go through the jungle here and see if we can get to... Just making sure it's not a creeper. I keep hearing something walk. There's parrots over there too. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a heads up that there seems to be some... Hi little kitty. Little ocelot I guess you are. There's another little baby ocelot. I heard something though. One of them got hurt. 
sounded like it might have been from a Oh, you know what? It might have been a parrot. Look at all of them. Cool. I've never actually seen those in game. I know they've been in for a while. Like I said, it's been a while since I've been to a jungle. Uh, but I'll probably, uh, you know, like get into that top of that tree. Probably get a really nice view. Uh, see if we can see how much farther um, this mansion is. So uh, that's the plan. Uh, I'm going to take another break, but uh, I just wanted to give, kind of give you guys a heads up. I'm afraid to sleep at this point because it seems to happen after I sleep. All right, welcome back, guys. Uh, I'll give you a quick little rundown here because I'm not sure how much of the last video I'm going to show. Uh, but basically, I had that weird death glitch again. I had slept in the bed over at the other place and you know uh closed out and when i came back and lit loaded in the game i had died and all my stuff was at spawn uh, you can see by my coordinates above here that i'm really far away from spawn uh, so basically i restarted a backup i had made just before i started recording this episode and uh, i had to basically get suited up again and come all the way back over here. Um, then I ran around this jungle for 45 minutes on top of a jackpot to find some bamboo because that's the only thing I didn't have. Well, after that, uh, I realized, you know, I looked on the wiki and found out that you got to fish for bamboo right now. Uh, so I did fish. I found one. So I got it planted here. So it'll grow and then I can expand that. So I believe we have all the materials we need to uh, duplicate the zoo. As a matter of fact, well, this is a good spot for a screenshot. Sorry about that, guys. But yeah, I got to rebuild this, you know, recreate it somehow in, inside the zoo. Uh, but uh, basically what I've done is set up in a different area. See, I got my pillar. Uh, the... Uh, Woodland Mansion is in that direction. I ran that way for quite a while and didn't run into it, so it's it's still a ways away. Um, so we're going to go ahead and set up in the the, uh, the jungle here, and I've already got materials collected. Let's just take a look at jackpot here. So yeah, I've already got a little over a stack and a half of wood, uh, 21 jungle saplings, which actually I think I'm going to bring with. And uh, cocoa beans, yeah. yeah, I'll hold off on those right now. I want the jungle wood is what I'm looking for. Okay, uh, so when I got over here, because this is like the closest jungle is kind of where it ends, and then you head off that way uh, to get to the mansion, which we'll have to do in future episodes. Um, but I was looking for a place to set up a portal, and I saw these caves up here. And I thought they looked really cool. And they are really cool. I did uh, run over there and take a quick look at them. They would make a great a great base. You know, you got some nice views. You know, I can picture, you know, just standing there in a porch and looking out. But uh, as I was parked up here and getting ready to, I was going to make this the main entrance. And that's when I had spotted this little cave down here. I have done no modifications. This is how it, it was when I found it. Uh, the vines are a little more grown now, but for the most part, that's it. So I'm like, oh, it's perfect. It's inside the jungle. I went inside and did a little exploration. And this is a really, uh, really cool cave system. Uh, there's a couple of spawners in here. I believe a skeleton and a spider I've found so far. I might have actually found three. There might be a zombie too. Hey, dude. Yeah, bye. Okay, so uh, basically, you know, I, you know me and my portals, I, I'd prefer to put them more underground. So, uh, yeah, there's the entryway. So we'll take some track down here. <clears throat> A 
I'll have to clean up probably this level here so I don't do that extra jump. And here's our portal and setup right here. And excuse the noises, but we now have Barrett the parrot. He's my pet. I couldn't help myself. Listen to him making creeper sounds, spider sounds. He was so funny. He was flying around in this cave while I was exploring, and I had a couple of seeds on me. So I, I went ahead and, and tamed him. So he is tamed. Uh, so he'll be my own personal parrot, I guess, because I'll, I'll catch some that aren't, you know, I'll try and catch some that aren't tamed and get them back. Uh, but unfortunately, the next step, I believe, is going back home to the zoo. Uh, you see, I got this nice little setup here. I got a chest of some extra things. Like I said, I had to fish for the bamboo, so I made myself a fishing pole. Here's some extra seeds. Um, so I'm ready to go into the nether and start working my way back to the zoo. So I have ways of getting back and forth, but I wanted to bring you guys with. I hate this uh, going through a portal the first time I'm always nervous but let's see where this portal ends up guys okay well that's not too terrible at least I'm not falling into lava right out off the bat so that's a good thing Okay, and I hear a gas, so I think the first thing I need to do is protect this portal.
Excellent. Okay, guys, I made it. Here's the uh, treks that uh, I had just caught the uh, magma cube with and brought him back to the zoo. So, I think we're in pretty good shape here. Okay, guys, I've been hard at work here in the nether again. So, uh, <laughs> this is the portal here uh, that the jungle mobs will be coming from. So when they transport into here, I mean, I still got some work to do, you know, block this side off and, you know, block this off so that they don't go anywhere but here. Um, but uh, let's go for a ride. Like I said, I'm a, I'm a panda or an ocelot right now, and I'm heading back to the zoo. It's quite a ride. Fun and scary. Still have to watch for ghasts. Uh, you notice I haven't dug out the two sides. I'm not sure if I'm going to on this one. Uh, I did have a uh, zombie pigman on the track, and I went right through him, so it might not even be an issue. Yeah, see, that's what I was afraid of. That's where the danger comes in. Got him. Excellent. So yeah, there's uh, it was pretty scary to do this, <clears throat> but uh, as you can see, it's rolling pretty good. So right now we're on our way to the zoo. This is all new track so far. See, there's a zombie pigman was in the way. Didn't really. There's that one little pause right there, and I don't know why. And same with right here, and don't know why. But that's the only spot that seems to slow down. Otherwise, it goes full speed every other time. But yeah, I don't have any of the stops put in yet or anything. Like I said, the, the purpose of this right now is to get the mobs in. Uh, there's the farthest nether uh, fortress right here. So we'll go inside. And you can see a treasure chest right there I never took. Uh, it is a little dangerous right up here because there is a, uh, yes, yeah, sp a spawner right there. Got one of them. And then we, that's where the uh, magma cube was. So I just kind of continued off of that. And you guys have seen this already. Uh, this, after this turn right here is where I caught the ghast. Both of them. This is the tunnel that they were both in. But uh, yeah, I've, I've done nothing except change my steering and, well, should kill that gas. But other than that, it's rolling good. All on its own. So this is a nice quick way to get all the way to the jungle. Still, still have to watch for, for gas. Uh, I'll figure out something for that, but it might take me a little while. This is a lot of track to lay down. Obviously, this took me several hours to do. But uh, it's obviously going pretty good. And here we are, off to the zoo. It'll kick me out like it should. There we go. Zoo. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put a poll up on the screen, guys. Uh, you can let me know what you think I should do for the jungle. Should I recreate a jungle temple to hold these mobs? Or should I do something like the witch, where I have the, uh, <clears throat> the, uh, the swamp biome recreated? Should I just recreate a jungle and just have one big jungle and have them all roaming? naturally inside the jungle um, the only thing I don't like about that idea is you got a big glass box you know which I don't really care about care for on the uh, the witch right now so um, I'm actually kind of leaning towards a temple right now but uh, yeah let me know what you think
Uh, I'm going to go ahead and head back. Okay, so let's let's time this ride here. It's uh, we'll go. We'll, I'm waiting for the clock up at the top that or the recording here. So we got ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go. So I started it right at six, six minutes. So yeah, I'm kind of tossed as to which way to go on, on doing the jungle. I like both ideas, actually. Um, maybe I could even combine them. Uh-oh, am I out of arrows? Oh, this isn't good. I'm probably out of arrows. Yeah, I'm out of arrows. Cool. I do have some in my ender chest, but... I'm glad I killed that one when I did. So he's not blowing up the track. But uh, yeah, there's the Ocean Monument portal. So I'll be putting stops in all these after we get these mobs back to the zoo. And then uh, you guys can actually, you know, ride this rail properly during the download. Or after the download. There's the uh, coral reef portal and the second yes yeah, this, this might get a little hairy I go pretty fast though so they don't even shoot me see <clears throat> I think it's kind of neat how we're actually riding right through the the nether fortress and then back out Yeah, it didn't surprise me I'm out of arrows because I've been killing a lot of ghasts as I've been building this railroad. See, right there is that little pause. I don't understand why. There's All the tracks are lit. There's nothing there to slow down the the cart so I'm not sure why there's that little pause right there but it has gone through every time so I guess I'm not gonna worry about it too much I'm gonna wanna attract the uh, Enderman while we're riding this Zoom and then zip and then zip. It's kind of a fun ride. Scary at the same time, like I said. Especially this big open area here. I'm really bummed I'm out of arrows right now. <clears throat> oh, he's there again. Or another one spawned there. But it's okay, because we are here. Oh, somehow I got an arrow. And to get the cart back, right? Oop. And here we are, back at the jungle. How you doing, Barrett the Parrot? This is him making the sound effects. When I found him, I had to kill a creeper to get to him. So the last thing he was by was a creeper. <clears throat> so he's making a lot of creeper sounds. That's what I was afraid of, but he's still cute. <clears throat> So I just got to put rail here. Okay, the bamboo hasn't grown at all. But uh, yeah, I just got to put the rail down to the portal. And uh, 
you know, set up some kind of a system up here to catch them. And uh, there should be, you know, ocelots and parrots and and uh, panda bears somewhere right around here. I know I'd seen them. But, uh, yeah, so we're, we're in pretty good shape. You saw the ride. I think we're ready to start bringing some of these... Uh, some of these mobs from the uh, jungle back home to the zoo. So, this is all I have time for today's episode. Sorry about that, guys, but uh, that railroads, uh, you know, it takes a lot of time to build one of those, even as cheesy as that is. But, uh, you know, and next episode, we can concentrate on starting to figure out what we're going to do. Uh, like I said, either build a, another fortress or a, a, a jungle temple rebuild one of those or uh, just create a biome for the for these guys and then just uh, drop them all in there so we almost got the track system ready to catch them so uh, we'll work on that for next episode so I'll see you later have a great day and thank you for joining me on another episode of bedrock zoo survival series bye <laughs>